What's going on, moviegoers? So if you're new to the channel, my name is Christian. Welcome to Sea World Productions. Always happening. It's happening. The Dormilaj hair is just too hot. I mean, why not have a spinoff series bringing back Okoye, the Nigerera, you guys? I am so excited. It has been confirmed by the Hollywood Reporter saying that Okoye is going to be getting her own spinoff series on Disney+. Plus. This is so exciting because I feel like the Dora Milaje are so interesting. They're so intriguing, powerful, beautiful, intelligent. That scene when they, in, in the Falcon and the Winter Soldier, when they were getting down, I, I, it was just, I was just, damn. Like, they, they steal the show whenever they're on the screen, you guys. It was so awesome. I cannot wait to see what they have in mind for this spinoff series. But let me read you guys some of this article from murphysmultiverse.com. Denai Guerrero to star in a Black Panther Okoye spin-off series for Disney+. Plus. When it got announced that Ryan Krugler is developing a series that takes place in Wakanda, we have no idea what direction this series will take. It might explore the founding of the fictional world of Wakanda and exploring its time opening up the borders to the rest of the world. Now it looks like there might be more development for Black Panther's franchise. As in an article exploring various lawyers in the entertainment industry, it mentions that Denai Guerrero will return for the up-and-coming Black Panther Forever film. The thing that stands out is that she will get an original Disney Plus series exploring her origins. Now, it is uncertain if it is Krugler's Wakanda series or potentially a unique project. That is interesting. Very interesting. Because we know that they're working on, they're going to be shooting Black Panther Wakanda Forever, literally in July, so very soon. And then after that, Ryan Coogler is going to go on and do the whole, you know, World of Wakanda series for Disney+. Plus. And then now that this gets announced, Okoye getting her own origin story spinoff. Interesting stuff, you guys. I mean, why not capitalize off the world of Wakanda? It is hot. Everybody likes the world of Black Panther. Why not utilize it and tell more unique stories within that world? There's so much more to tell. And I'm pretty sure everybody is fine with them doing, you know, I always thought like I'm down for a, you know, a spinoff, you know, series on Disney plus for, you know, the Dora Milaje. I mean, that, that why not? That's just so badass. But now you have Okoye going to be leading the Dora Milaje potentially for her, you know, her own origin story of her upbringing. That is, that, I'll take it. That, I think that's awesome. The only complications I think it's going to have is, you know, with Chadwick Boseman passing away, you know, not having him attached to the series, you know, how they're going to explain that, you know, because especially if it's an origin story, she's been by her king for a certain amount of years. And before that, it was King T'Chaka. Do you bring back, to, you know, King T'Chaka for the series? You know what I mean? So it's going to be pretty interesting to see. And I can, I can, I can see where they're coming at and I can see where they can go. Maybe T'Challa was overseas, you know, doing school or whatever. You know what I'm saying? So they can kind of explore that and, you know, give that, you know, giving that the reason of why, you know, T'Challa isn't in the series. I and mean, it makes a lot of sense. They could go down that direction. But I'm with it. This is a fabulous, fabulous idea. There's so much potential they can do. And to bring more of the world of Wakanda, you guys, you know, I'm with it. You know, even if Ryan Coogler isn't going to be directing this particular series, best believe he's going to have some writing. Best believe he's going to be producing. He is in the world of Wakanda. And if you're Kevin Feige at Marvel Studios, you don't get somebody else you know, not to be involved in this this particular world. You, you you have Ryan Coogler be your foundation for every project you plan on doing in the world of Wakanda. Because what he established in the first Black Panther film, you know what I mean, won so many Oscars. Uh, really unfortunate, didn't win Best Director and Best Picture. Um, but like I said, you want Ryan Coogler to continue on in this franchise. But this is interesting news, you guys, and I definitely, I definitely like it. It's going to be awesome. But post your comments down below. Let me know what you guys think about Okoye getting her origin spinoff series on Disney Plus. Thoughts and opinions, you guys. What do you guys think? Post your comments down below, you guys. Peace.